The Brits are deploying drones to send medical supplies to remote areas. Meanwhile, America's top health expert has said that the death toll in this country, the actual toll is higher than the official numbers. And people in South Korea are lining up outside Chanel stores. These stories and more on the Gravitas Coronavirus Tracker. A fixed-wing twin-engined UAV will be used to deliver medical supplies to a hospital in the Isle of Wight. The hospital lies 8 kilometers off the south coast of England. The UAV can carry a payload of 100 kilos. A mother who successfully fought the novel coronavirus was reunited with her newborn baby for the first time. Isabel Gonzalez was admitted to the Massachusetts General Hospital two weeks ago. She delivered the baby on the 30th of March. More than a hundred shoppers lined up at a Chanel store in Seoul, South Korea. This is after rumors of price hikes spread across the city. Some shoppers lined up as early as 5 a.m. The store issued tickets online to keep order. UK royals, including the 94-year-old Queen, paid a tribute to nurses around the world on International Nurses' Day. They interacted with healthcare workers from Australia, India, Africa and the Caribbean. Parisians flocked to cosmetic stores and beauty parlours a day after exiting an eight-week lockdown. Non-essential shops including factories and non-essential businesses reopened for the first time in eight weeks. Drone footage showed Parisians with face masks also flocking to the Eiffel Tower. 275 health and social care professionals have died in the UK due to the Wuhan virus. British Prime Minister Boris Johnson called the toll stark and deeply horrifying. The list includes 144 National Health Service and 131 social care workers. The UK has the highest death toll in Europe and is expected to go up. Saudi Arabia will enforce a countrywide 24-hour curfew during the five-day Eid holiday. The curfew will apply from the 23rd of May till the 27th of May, following the end of the fasting month of Ramzan. Commercial and business enterprises will remain open till then. Dr. Anthony Fauci says the actual death toll in the United States of America could be higher than the official figure. Fauci says those who could not get access to healthcare system may not have been included in the official toll. Fauci also warned against relaxing lockdowns too soon, saying the consequences could be serious. Germany, France, Austria and Switzerland will relax border restrictions from this weekend. All of Germany's crossings with these three countries will be reopened. Currently, only select border crossings are open. London Mayor Sadiq Khan has opposed the restart of Premier League football next month. He says the situation isn't conducive for resumption of sports. Sadiq Khan is a known fan of Liverpool, who will likely win the league if it restarts. Five EPL clubs are based in London.